Hi, this is Jake of the Forge Up Video Crew, and we have another tutorial for you guys today. This is what I'd like to call physics gates, or basically these are interactable objects that are using the in-game normal physics. So here we have a gate that is very similar to the functionality of the turf gate from Halo 2. So we're going to grab a hog here because it's much more epic, and we're going to ram right through it. Just like that. So, how this works is fairly simple. All we are doing is welding an object, putting it on normal physics, and putting it in a place that allows it to move in the ways we want to. So, with this, all we I use just a panel and uh, a pipe, and this pipe's a uh, uh, 32 in height, I believe. So I basically first just put it in phase, group it, then weld it, it needs to be welded. And then you want to create a sort of way to restrict its movement, since if we didn't have a thing up here it would just fall over. So what we have here is we have two little pipes and then these two blocks. And this creates a sort of holster or a hole for the axle of the, which is in this case, this pole. And with, do not suck these up too close to it. Like you want to make it pretty damn close, but not so close that it, like basically what happens if you make it like touching really close, it will actually glitch out. And uh, for me, it crashed my game. So be careful with that. And then you just, after you've put it into that and you've welded it, then you just put it on normal physics and that's it. Now the applications of this are practically infinite. I've seen so many possibilities. You can, they were used for the original hanging baskets on the Ferris wheel on Hangout, which I eventually removed sadly. And they were, I've seen it on Wipeout where the this person's Wipeout course, they had it with the obstacles that would swing back and forth. You re there's so many possibilities with this, so I thought it was really important to show. So, thank you all for watching. This has been Jake of the Forge of Video Crew, and I'll see you guys next time. Laters.